Irene's notes was true. I mean, all the stuff I love about Holly as a friend drives me crazy at work. I mean, have you ever heard of gay prunes? Well, I mean, my grandfather has this roommate, but I mean, I'm pretty sure they're just sharing expenses. <laughs> I mean, if Holly doesn't want what I want, maybe I'm better off without her. I hate to say it, but maybe our partnership has run its course. Well, I mean, she can kind of be self-centered, you know, like she always keeps us waiting. Yeah. But, I mean, what do I know? Just ignore me, or maybe I have a point. No. No, you're absolutely right. God, Sarah, I'm so grateful to have you to talk to about this. Oh, I'm just so glad that you want to. I mean, I was starting to wonder, okay, can get ready, because this is completely lame, but um, I just was worried that you liked her more than me. What? I know. No, you nerd linger. So I'm still your best friend? You know you are, Sarah, since the third grade. Where's all this coming from, anyway? Oh, I don't know. I mean, ever since I started going out with Todd again, I mean, I spend all my time with him, and you spend all your time with Holly, and then I start to think, like, why don't you want to be with me? And I know that you do, but I'm just being insecure, and I just need some reassurances, and oh, boy. Oh, sweetie. Hey, do you want to go to this party with me tonight? I mean, after all, you are my best friend. Okay, stop saying that. I'd love to. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh, who's dead? Donde unos papeles importante de mi desk? Uh, no puedo find them in mi handwriting. Como este? You do that by hand? Very good. It looks like a typewriter wrote it. <laughs> I've always had a knack for penmanship. Just go through all that and see if you can find my private notes. You want me to read all the trash? Of course not. Just skim it. <laughs> so, what can I get for you ladies? I'll have a uh, Kettle One Gimlet Rocks. Ooh, that sounds so good. Me too. But I thought you were being an alcoholic. Well, I don't think I've nearly hit bottom yet. <laughs> I need a night off. Cone of silence? Oh, God, I hope Todd doesn't say stuff like that behind my back. <laughs> okay, there they are. Are you, are you okay if I go schmooze for a sec? Yeah, sure, go ahead. I'll just stand here and enjoy the view. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but you can't believe how hard to fight for a zoom, zoom, zoom. Then sales spiked 40%, and that's what I knew. I had them by the short and curlies. <laughs> oh, no. Boy, can I relate. You don't know how hard it was to get those tampon people to approve. Everybody in the pool! <laughs> that was yours? I love that spot. Oh, yeah, JJ's been doing some really innovative stuff. Oh, shucks, Doug. More and more. So why are you working for me? She's in Irene's group. She keeps us all chained to our desk so we can't catch a glimpse of all your Clio awards. <laughs> but who needs awards, you know? It's all about the work, right? Oh, thank you. Thank you. But this award really belongs to our new rising star, who is not only creative, talented, and smart, but she's super, super hot, J.J. Hayden. Yeah. Thank you, Kim. You know, I'd like to say I couldn't have done it without you, but it's not true. I'm a freaking genius. Woo! Oh. Now, that's the woo I was looking for. <laughs> Meanwhile, it's the quicker picker upper. No, no, it's too generic. And prune merchandising. I'm seeing video games, movies, lunchboxes for the kids, plush toys. Possibly a theme park. Cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. Oh, who am I kidding? That's not so great. <gasps> They're great! <laughs> oh, and this would make the best Broadway musical? I mean, if you're in town with such a big hit, why not Prune Town? Now I know what this reminds me of. The third best commercial of all time. The California Raisins, I heard it through the Grapevine campaign. The what? Yeah. No. That's it. That's the one. No, no. I mean, I can see the similarities, sure, but those raisins weren't gay. Uh, they were singing and dancing and wearing identical outfits. Okay, even a straight dude like me can tell that those raisins were gay, gay, gay. <laughs> <laughs> well, I heard it through engraving. Woo! How much longer will you be mine? Stop, 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 stop it all! God, it's like nails on a chalkboard. No, no. I could never recommend somebody who loves the California raisins. It's personal. 
Janitorial staff, D minus. <laughs> From now on, when you find dust bunnies in the corners, and you will, don't come crying to me. I've got to get on your team. Well, actually, my copywriter is thinking about moving over to Burnett. Really? Sarah? Oh, hi, Holly. What are you doing here? And where's JJ? And why are you kissing a guy who's not Todd? Oh, this is Rick. Guy, his gimlets are so good. I'm a kissaholic. You and I could do some killer work together. Although, uh, well, you already have a partner, so it's too bad. Um, that might not be a problem, actually. See, Holly's thinking about getting out of advertising altogether. Well, what does she want to do? Some cartoon about gay prunes. Uh, it's funny, it sounded like you said gay prunes. Hey, JJ. Hi, you're here. Yeah. So you're leaving to develop a cartoon. Good luck with that. What? Oh, no, I, I, I didn't say that you were leaving. I just maybe said that... Well, don't worry about JJ. We're already talking about partnering up. Holly, no. No. You know what? <clears throat> Whatever. Look, I did some rough layouts for the prune campaign. You know the account I thought we were working on together? Yes. But here. Enjoy it with your new partner. Holly, no. I just... Oh, God. JJ, help. I'm gonna be sick. Um, all right, let's go. Make a hole, make it wide. <laughs>